Hello everyone, my name is Griff, and today we are going to be summoning on Ilya's Prize Showcase. I took a few weeks off from making content and playing really aggressively to gather a lot, I must prepare to but give my readings. I am going what to be summoning on you? this banner. Um, before I do though, I do want to go over some of the stuff that was announced while I was gone. There was a This Month in Dragalia Lost a couple of weeks ago, almost two weeks ago now. There was a anniversary event music compilation. There was a bunch of changes to, uh, I believe there were a changes to the 3D appearance and stuff like that. There was the announcement of the size showcase. There was Galazena's banner. They confirmed that Agito weapon prices are not going to change, which is a little disappointing to me. And now today they've announced that they are going to be adding the mana spiral to more characters. Um, the other thing that they didn't announce yet, which I'm a little more hurt by, is we do have this. Let me pull it up right now if I can find it. This uh, problematic post-mortem post-mortem panic, excuse me, with um, these two characters, who I think both are just adorable. But uh, they didn't announce a banner for them. They also there is also an Eden alt there, but I don't think that's going to turn into much of anything. That's kind of interesting. But the next banner is a prize showcase, so I was kind of hoping that they would be the next banner. But hopefully they'll pull uh, up around the end of the month. As far as the daily ten votes have gone, I haven't gotten too much new stuff through them. I, um, one of the days I did end up getting a platinum prize. And it was a Damascus ingot, which is the worst prize of the uh, platinum prizes, which was not great. Uh, another day, I did get a gold prize, and that was two golden alchemy. keys, which Just again watch. is probably one of the worst prizes, which was not great. As far as units go, I did get uh, Summer Samoa through that, so I'm pretty hyped about her. But otherwise, I haven't gotten too Just much. Watch. And if you notice, I do have a lot of Wormite, but my tickets are down. That is because I did, in fact, end up summoning on... Kalazena's banner. I didn't have to go all the way to 300. I went to about 200 summons, but I did end up getting her. That's pretty cool. But that's enough preliminary stuff. Let's get right into the summons. My current pity rate is five and a half because I haven't gotten a five star in a few days. So let's see what we get on this one. And as far as I'm concerned, I am 100% willing to go all the way to 300 to get her. Although I do want to see the gun drop. That's one of the things I really wanted to see. And we we're getting a flash already. I do want I did want to see the gun drop. So I was pretty hyped for that. Let's see. It is the fourth one. Now of course this isn't a gala, which means that our five star rates are gonna be pretty bad. And as I've said, I'm going in without doing a lot of singles because I don't have a lot of single tickets. It's mostly gonna be tenfold. So we're gonna have to see how that is. Ooh, I forgot he was right there. Okay that was sticks I believe. Yeah, that was sticks. Uh, one of the worst dragons in the game. One of the worst five stars in the game. Not too fortunate for me. But we have about 210 summons more to go. I don't know if I'm going to end up getting her through the worm sigils or if I'm going to get her from the drop. But we're going to just going to see right now. I do actually have enough to confirm. Oh, a five star already. I do have enough to confirm at least two characters with worm sigils. So that's pretty cool. Oh, two. Okay. There's a blade. Okay, and there's a dragon. I don't know if I'm missing any blades. The see. Hmm. Okay, oh, I'm missing Natalie. Okay. That's awesome. Um, this character's not too good anymore. I don't know how she is after the changes to the everyone. We have Cerberus. Okay, cool. I don't know how she is after the changes, but Ready to have a little fun, huh? as far as I'm aware, she's never been... She was originally when she first came out, she was super good, but then Iyasu came out after her, and that was kind of a disappointing thing. But, yeah. Glad to have her, have her in my collection now. That's awesome. Two five stars on the first tenfold. That's going to be... Uh... I'm using all my luck now. Alright, let's see. We got some birds. Maybe they'll transform into a 5 star. Hidden Gala rates, apparently. Nope. Okay, 3 4 stars. I'll want to just stay in case any of them transform, but I already have every 4 star in the game, so if it comes down to it, I will just skip this and we can get right into the prizes. Yep. Into the prizes. Okay, let's see. 
not even a silver prize unfortunate but i am getting a lot of these uh damascus uh, crystals which i will use to make dra uh, high dragon weapons so that's kind of fun well let's keep going let's see what we get here a lot of more birds again oh and it is a five star okay hidden gala rates let's go just one five star and one four star okay let's see what we get it's a dragon okay Four star, but I already know I have it. And the dragon is okay. Pazuzu. Okay. I don't know how, how unbind my Pazuzu is, but we'll have to see. Silver prize. Okay. That's gonna be it for this. And I got some rainbow orbs. Nice. I don't know how unbind my Pazuzu is. I don't know if Pazuzu is that good anymore with Bayou being with how good Bayou is. So I don't know how lucky it is to get another one of him but we'll have to see i do want to try master ciela i have not done that at all yet uh, i don't know if i'm gonna try it in auto or if i'm gonna try it in co-op because i actually do have all the units i need to promote for auto i just don't have the weapons for them yet so we're gonna have to see what i can do with that i did get a gold prize though and a silver prize let's see what do we get in the gold Okay, two golden TP. That is why I'm summoning so hard. Normally, on a normal banner, I would be very hard for me to decide whether I want to summon or not, but prize showcases are usually the highest value banners you can go in on. So, I am actually going to go in on them quite aggressively. And since we haven't had an announcement of a collab, since they haven't said, oh, here's the new collab, I don't mind summoning on this as much, especially since I really like Ilya. I think it's hilarious that this goddess of uh, this religion is just a gun wielding like super smart girl kind of funny to me and you know i had a a personal determination to collect all the mana casters and we'll see whether i trade for her or whether i get her on my team what i did before this banner and also again i got two golden keys from a golden prize yay <laughs> I guess that's a free unbind on a worm print, which is good because then I can just get a free copy of it if I didn't already have it. But otherwise, it's not too great. Let's see what we got here. Okay, three, one, two. Let's see if the last one at the end transforms. I I don't know if anyone has seen. Someone must have seen it. The golden version of the gun, because obviously it would instantly transform to the uh, the rainbow version, but. Yeah, that's interesting. Oh, okay. So my door, not too shabby at all. We're about halfway there from the con from the confirmation. So let's see what happens here. One new unit already is super good for me, especially on a non-gala banner. Oh, I'm skipping this. That's terrible. Yeah, disappointing. But it is what it is. And usually I would do single summons before, but I actually don't have many singles, like I said, so that's a little, a little iffy. But we did get a 5 star here. Hopefully not a dragon. We'll have to see what we get. One, two, three, four. Oh, there she is. Okay, so that's cool. That's really cool. Okay. I like the way it looks. Boom. Ilya. The goddess's judgment. That it looks like a like Just a kidding. giant pistol, really. That's cool though. I'm super excited to use her. And I will quickly go to my teams in a second. That's awesome. We didn't we actually only spent around just under 10k or might to get her. So that's awesome. I think I still I don't think I have just enough. Actually I have enough for at least one confirmation on a character if I wanted to get a confirmation on a character. But I do have Ilya. That's awesome. Dope, 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 dope. So let's quickly go to the No Limit, collect all these prizes. I think I have like a few dragons in here probably. Yeah, a few dragons. Bunch of rupees. Gotta love that. You know, rupee, rupees are really a hot commodity now due to the Akito changes. But I'm gonna quickly go. I'm gonna say goodbye, Fleur. I'm actually going to put Ilya on right now to show that I did, judgment. in fact, make <laughs> a fully kidding. unbound Agito mana caster. 
So I'm gonna slap that on her. It is ginormous on her. I'm just gonna put uh, keep it on her. I have no idea how good she is, and I, I've seen clips of her like destroying uh, Master Zodi in like like seven seconds or something crazy like that. So I don't know exactly how good she is, but I just want her because you know she's just an important character. Small bit of waifu bias, you know, you see this girl with a giant gun, that's really funny to me. But, yeah, that's going to be it for me for today. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.